So today we're going to talk about the new Ghostbusters film. I am a huge movie fan and I love the classics, but I don't like so much the classics being remade. I don't mind spin-offs and things like that. I love Arnold Schwarzenegger films, I'm a huge Arnold Schwarzenegger fan. For those that don't know, I did not like the remakes of Total Recall and anything else that may have been remade. I didn't enjoy the Robocop remake. The original was good enough, doesn't need to be touched. And the same goes for Ghostbusters, that is my belief. So before we carry on, I'll just say there may be some spoilers for the movie as reviews are starting to come out and most are not so positive as people expected. So just as a warning, I don't want anybody to get upset if I tell you what's going on in the movie, but pretty much I'm going to go over the things that the feminazis are blaming men for, when in fact the movie is making men look bad. So I've heard from these reviews. So let's go into it a little bit more in depth from what I've heard or understand from reviews and other YouTube channels that have seen the film and see if we can understand a little bit more what Ghostbusters 2016 is all about. And to start off with, we'll go with the director, Paul Feig, who does like to make his old chick flicks. Oh yes, he does. And let me just reiterate on the opening of the video, I am not saying I don't like the film because there are female leads. This has potential, I do like things to be mixed up a little bit, but I just want you to put in the comments below one remake of a classic 80s film that we all grew up with that was even on par with the original, let alone better. They all seem to fail and be complete shit. Total Recall, for example, which I started off with in the beginning, and Robocop. Nothing compared to the original, why remake it? They, they were classics, they're classics, don't touch them. Same with Ghostbusters, um, but that, enough for that. It's nothing to do with the females, it is possible. I believe that it's the direction of the film and the writing that probably hasn't achieved it. A lot of people are saying, even watching the film now, the jokes are flat. There's nothing there. Now that's not to blame Melissa McCarthy or the other actresses taking part in the movie. I uh, actually like Melissa McCarthy. I've watched a couple of her films with the wife. We actually have most of her films, in fact. Spy, one of the last films we see, which I believe was directed by Paul Feig, was actually not bad. Um, you know, it's, it was a good film. It was entertaining. It was different. And Melissa McCarthy did a very good job. And from some of her performances, I've actually looked out for other films that she's been in. So before any feminazis come in here blaming everybody for not liking it because of the actresses, go fuck off, because that's nothing to do with it. If the writing's shit, the film is shit. If the director's shit, the film is shit. Jokes are flat, the film is shit. I could go on. That's just not mentioning the special effects as well. Apparently it is, just like Haunted Mansion, Eddie Murphy, Disney film, or Scooby-Doo, the uh, live-action Scooby-Doo's. Uh, visual effects are pretty much that, a child's film. And with all that being said and out the way, let's move on to the subject of the video, the male actors in the film. Now, the film from what I understand from reviews and other YouTube channels as mentioned earlier, the male characters in the film are made to either be assholes or complete idiots. Now of course we have Chris Emsworth as the secretary of the team. In the original 1984 classic, Annie Potts played the secretary, Janine Melnitz, whose role for the most part was a generic secretary role, although being a very memorable one. Whereas Chris Hemsworth's character is made to look a bit more of a klutz or an idiot, a bit clumsy. All that being said as well, Chris Hemsworth apparently is the best part about the new Ghostbusters film. But like I said, tip of the iceberg with men looking like assholes in the movie, apparently every single man, male, character, everything is all made to look like an asshole. And this is where I get to the spoilery parts. This is the real juice, juicy parts. The end, end boss, sorry, uh, baddie, I'm used to games, too used to games, is apparently killed by the Ghostbuster females by shooting him in the dick. Now, my rant here is about to begin. The feminazis that battle and upset a lot of YouTube channels, like Cinemassacre where they attacked and destroyed his video for saying that he was anti-female and you are anti woman blah blah blah, and now the film is being watched. It appears the film may be anti-man, anti-male? Ooh, interesting. So, I don't know what your guys' thoughts are on this, so every single man is made to look like an asshole, an idiot, or stupid, and the end bad guy is killed by shooting him in the dick, yet some people that might not like the film because there are females in it can't say anything without being attacked by feminists or feminazis, but the film can attack men openly, make men look bad and kill somebody by shooting them in the dick, and making it very quite clear actually that women are the top dog and we can say goodbye to our classic memories. I don't know. I don't know. You tell me in the comments below. 
I don't, I'm just saying. I'm just saying this thing. I'm just bringing it up. That's all it is. I'm not saying anything. You know what I'm saying? I'm married. I got kids. I love women. I'm not anti-women. I love women. I love my mum. My mum brought me into this world. My wife, she brought my children into the world, which I love more than anything. So this is just a general conversation we're having right here. Although a little bit ranty. By the way, have you heard the new Ghostbusters theme song by Fall Out Boy and Missy Elliott? What the fuck is that? I'll leave links in the description to the original theme song, as well as this new one, so you can have a listen with your sound holes. Now, I'd love to read your thoughts on the new Ghostbusters film in the comments below. Have you seen it? I don't think it's out in the UK yet. I probably will go and see it, just to verify this information and maybe make an updated video later. Also, let me know in the comments below if you like this kind of video. I love movies. I think this could be something different I could do on my channel maybe, um, to just alternate between games and things like that when things are a bit quiet. I don't know. Leave a like if you liked the video, let me know what you think of the new Ghostbusters film compared to the original, or just originals being remade, the classic 80 films being remade in general, and I'll see you peeps next time. I like the ladies! <laughs>